Good morning, readers. This morning, we are going to be reading a story called If You Plant a Seed. And we're gonna be talking about a strategy that readers use as they're reading to make sure that they're really understanding what they've read. And one of the things that good readers do is they ask themselves questions as they read a story. They might ask, I wonder why, or they might ask, where does something happen? Or what does something mean? So as we're reading our story today, if you plan to seed, we're gonna pause and ask ourselves some questions. So it's, if you plan to seed, words and paintings by Kadir Nelson. If you plant a seed. If you plant a tomato seed, a carrot seed, and a cabbage seed, in time, with love and care, oh, I see some rain there too, tomato, carrot, and cabbage plants will grow. Look how excited they are. Mmm, delicious. Oh, I see some things in the background here. I wonder if they're gonna become part of the story. Let's see. Oh. Do you have a question about these birds here? I'm wondering why they've come. I see all the vegetables that the rabbit and the mouse planted. Maybe they're hungry. Mm. Do they look hungry to you? If you plant a seed of selfishness, uh-oh, does it look like the rabbit and the mouse are wanting to share? Looks like they're being a little selfish. In a very short time, it will grow and grow and grow. Look at what that seed of selfishness grew into. I wonder why the rabbit and the mouse didn't want to share with the birds. Why do you think they didn't want to share? Maybe, maybe they're not sure if the birds are friendly or Maybe they're a little uncomfortable with the birds. Oh, so what did it say here? It will grow and grow and grow into a heap of trouble. Wow, what a mess. That little seed of selfishness they didn't want to share with the birds. Hmm. If you plant a seed of kindness, look what the mouse is doing there with the birds. He's offering that one last cherry tomato. In almost no time at all. Oh, they're watching the birds fly away. Wonder where those birds might be going. Do you have a guess? The fruits of kindness, oh, look what they're dropping from the sky, will grow and grow and grow. Whoa, look at that. And they are very, very sweet. Look at those seed, what those seeds of kindness grew. Such better sharing going on here. If we look back to this page, oh, look at all that chaos compared to this page. I think I would rather be here. The end. So as we were reading today, we asked ourselves some questions. We wondered why things were happening and we kind of took some time to think a little bit more deeply about the story. So when you're reading a book or when someone is reading to you, readers, I want you to start stopping 
and thinking about what questions you have. What does it make you wonder about? What kinds of things do you want to know more about? And turn and talk to a grown up about it, or even just talk to the stuffies in your room if you wanted to, and have a little conversation about why things might be happening in the story. So starting today and forever and ever, I want you to start asking yourself questions as you read. All right, readers, I'll see you later. Bye.